Right. It's and so what, what I did felt. then was I built a couple. Of, so that actually is okay because of collage. Um, so I think there's something to be said about the fact that this is an early drawing. Okay. And my work, my work was, and I have several pieces like this. Um, like I fell in love with every inch of this piece of paper and every, I mean, it's there spectacularly detailed like an oil painting in Prismacolor. Um, and they take six to eight months if I'm working pretty much a lot on them to get them done. But they were, I've always put images together by going, oh, I kind of like this from here. And I kind of like this from here. And let's merge the sizes and put them together. And then when I wasn't doing art, I did scrapbooks. So that's pictures of my life and sitting mm -hmm. around with my girlfriends and everybody's working on theirs. And we're, we're have, a, I don't know if you've ever seen the craft world of scrapbooking, but in the United States, they literally will have a, a room full of hundreds of women who all come in with their stuff and sit at tables and okay. talk about their lives like old fashioned quilting bees, putting pictures on paper and, and arranging them with stickers and other things and making collage. Is that uh, what you were doing? Or that's what I was part doing. Of that? I was you part were in of that. that room with hundreds of I was of in that, women? I didn't do the large room oh. so much as the small gatherings of friends. But okay. there's something, once again, this connection piece yeah, that yeah. runs in and out of my creativity. So mm -hmm. that led me to, but then at some point I just got tired. The artist in me gets tired of doing scrapbooks. So this, if you can see it, and then you'll see that connection between this and the images behind me. Yes. Yeah. This is a collage, a large self-portrait of um that is a collage but it's also done with scrapbooking supplies and techniques 